Hi everyone, do you have cracked heels that just won't heal? I'm going to show you a way to get them to. So if you would like to know what my technique is, then do please stay tuned. Welcome back. My name is Wendy. Welcome to my channel. I would like to say hello to my faithful subscribers from long, long ago and hello to my new subscribers. So my whole life I've had trouble with the backs of my heels cracking open and bleeding. Um, I have tried foot claims. I have tried all kinds of devices. I um, even purchased one of the recent ones, the um, little roller thing that comes for your feet to sand the dead skin off. I even have one of those. Nothing worked for me. The pet egg. Um, I've spent so much money on trying to heal my heels. But I found a way to do it, and it doesn't cost very much money at all. Now, it's kind of unconventional. Um, it's not something that you would think of doing, but hey, I, I thought of it, I did it, and it works. The first thing that you do is you go to Lowe's and you buy this. It's sandpaper. Yes, it is. And I purchased the um, 60 grain for sheetrock. It says it right there. Um, it's coarse 60. And it's in the sheetrock finishing area. But then I had the sandpaper. But I didn't have anything to put the sandpaper on. To be able to hold on to the sandpaper to file my heels or sand my heels. So I got to rummaging through all of my stuff and I found this. It's an old towel rack thing. Holder. It's made out of wood and it's a perfect candle. Perfect. I can hold on to this and hold on to it for a long time without it hurting my hands. And I took and cut out a piece of sandpaper and hot glued it to the bottom. Now, you can use anything that you can hot glue the sandpaper to that has a handle that you can hold with your hand. You know, and it needs to be pretty sturdy because you're going to be um, sanding your heels. And that's a lot of friction. You don't want it to be slipping all the time. So, find something that has a good handle on it. And hot glue you a piece of sandpaper, the shape of whatever you decide to use. Cut it out. Hot glue it to the bottom. Do this about every other day to begin with. I did it every other day. Um, even uh, when my heels were busted open when I first started, I would just lightly sand that area, you know, where the skin had like opened up and made the crack. I would sand the sides of that if I could stand it. And when I finished, I'd sand my whole heel and then I would wash it really, really good to get all the sandpaper, um, all the sandpaper granules out of the cracks. And then I would apply this. And I firmly believe in this stuff because it's the only cream that I have ever bought that actually worked. But it only worked in combination with the sandpaper method. Gold Bond Ultimate Healing Foot Cream. This with aloe. This stuff really, really works. It's, it's better than any other foot cream that I have ever used. And I have tried so many different kinds. The Avon kind, the kind that comes in the little uh, jars, tubes. I've tried it all. And um, none of it worked except for this for extremely dry cracked heels. 
This technique will get them well. Once you get them well, you do not have to sand them as often. You just want to sand them every other day till you get them down to a normal looking heel. To where they do not have all of that thick, thick, dead skin on them. And then you just have to do it about once a week to maintain it. Um, but you do have to maintain it or it will come back. But that's my unconventional way of how I got my heels well. Because they used to bust open all of the time. And um, I got sick of it. I got sick of being in pain and not being able to walk around. And um, I came up with this idea one day whenever somebody, I was kidding around with somebody that I needed a belt sander or a handheld, you know, um, sander to sand my feet with. And I thought of sandpaper. And then my husband had brought some home from work and I tried it and it actually worked. So that is my method of getting rid of of all that thick dead skin so your heels can actually get well. I hope that this helps somebody. If it doesn't, then so be it. Now you know how I got my heels well uh, and stopped them from uh, busting open all the time and bleeding. Everybody be safe, be kind to one another, and I'll see you in my next upload. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful day.